What's going on guys, Casual Savage here, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to set up your Xbox One. Okay, so, I've already connected the power brick, you can see there. So I'm just going to plug it into the socket. And then this one, which is connected to the power brick, the orange light's on there, it goes to the back. Actually, I'll turn it around just so you can see it. It goes right there. So I'm just going to go ahead and plug that in. Oh, it reaches all the way around, that's good. And that's in. Next, we need to set up the connect. Okay, so the connect goes. The connect was actually really long, longer than I expected. So, so the connect wire goes to a block, and I oh wait, just got to take this off. I forgot about that. Okay, so it goes to a weird shape like that. And that one is up here. So it's this one right here. The one next to the two USB ports. And it's in. So, last thing we've got to connect is the HDMI cables. And I've just got to go and ahead and undo this again. Okay, so they're done. Now the HDMI cable's pretty obvious where it's got to go. So, it's HDMI in or HDMI t or HDMI out to TV. Obviously, it's going to the TV, so we put it as that. So, it's going to this one right here, right next to the power source. So, that is how your Xbox should look from the back. So now I'm going to switch, turn it around, and I'll be back to you when it's done. So the Xbox is turned around. While I was turning it around, the Xbox did turn on, but obviously it's not connected to the HDMI, so I didn't see it on the TV. So now we'll connect it, the HDMI to the TV. Okay, HDMI. Right here. It's pretty obvious where it goes on your TV. Just look for the HDMI. And there's mine right there. It says HDMI in. So I'm going to go ahead and plug it in. Oops, there we go. There we go. That's pretty hard doing it in one hand. But yeah. So now that should hopefully be connected. We'll just turn the TV on. Okay, so I just found out something new as well. If you have connected the HDMI cable and it's not TV output, then you just have to switch the HDMI cables around so that HDMI cable would go to the TV and the one on the TV would go to the back of the console. So we're going to turn the Xbox on. There you go. If you remember on the 360, it used to just be, HDMI always used to be on even if the console wasn't turned on. But now you have to have the console turned on. So it comes up. So this is my first ever time actually booting this up. Connect is on. Wow, they're bright on the camera. It's not actually that bright in person. They're really faint. So I don't know why it's like that. Here we go. So now we just got to connect the controller. Up. Press A. Oh, connected already. I did not even have to do that sync thing. So just press English. United Kingdom. 
which of these is yours? So, uh, yeah, you're not gonna see my U network password, good boy. So hopefully it connects now. And yeah, it feels good without that uh, thing you usually have to have in the back, because I had that old white 360. You are connected. Press A. And it's just got a little update to do now. And just click A to start the update. So I'm going to be back to you when it is done. So it's almost finished on 99% now. And it is done. It's restarting. So it may take a moment. And as you can see, I've taken off the wrapper that was on the Connect. And for those that haven't seen my unboxing video, there will be a link to that in the description. And if you didn't know, I did get FIFA 14 with this. That's all I've got at the moment, but I'm planning to get Rise, Call of Duty Ghosts, and Forza Motorsport 5. And a possibility of Dead Rising 3. But obviously the game's like £55 each now, so I won't be able to get them. Straight away. I'm not sure how long this is going to take. So I'll be back to you when it's done. Got a little bit left now, it's almost done. Just to prove we've got FIFA 14, here it is. Yeah, I'm making this video straight after I've done the unboxing video. So that's why I decided to do a setup video as well. And I didn't get the day one edition, I just got the normal edition. I was going to get the day one edition, but when I decided to get it, it was out of stock. I was lucky to get this one, I thought I was going to end up getting it January the 7th, 2014, but I managed to get one. As for my gaming channel, I'll be doing games on this now, obviously. I still have my 360, but that is dead, I guess. It can't read disk, the disk drive's broke, and it costs £20 to repair, so I've got this, so I don't really need it anymore. And, uh, I'm planning to do a smashing video, which should be fun. Actually, two Xbox 360s, we're going to smash them and upload it. But yeah, on about my gaming channel, on this I will be doing, I might be doing FIFA 14 videos, I'm not too sure on that yet. Look through that. The lights aren't even there. Must just be the camera then. They are actually really faint lights. I don't know why it's coming like that on the camera, but... Okay, so... The... Time... Zone set up, just press next. Uh, we'd like to set up. I might as well set that, set that up now. Does your connect see you? <laughs> yeah, it does, my phone. Start audio chip. Turn your volume up. The speakers are too quiet. Try turning the volume up. So I'll turn it up again. You've got to hear that. So it sounds great, and yeah, I wasn't speaking then because of, uh, it said stay quiet. Move center, change your sound settings, yep, okay, just click next. Everything is good, when you play connect together, remember to take a break if you become tired or sore. 
for more info yet yeah, uh, if you move your connect center you can set it up again in settings connect center and then yeah there are two power options for your xbox while you're not using it let's take a look so the energy saving uh, slow startup or instant startup okay uh, you don't really say to do anything oh it's still going on instant updates gets updates automatically or okay I'd rather have the faster stuff next you will sign in with your Microsoft account if you already have a game tag use the email okay so I just got to get my game tag back this video is taking longer than I actually expected I thought it'd be like five minutes but um, yeah so I'm just gonna quickly sign in okay your privacy control you can read that if you want to, I'm just pressing next. Your Xbox should stay the... W your Xbox should look the way you want, okay. Um... Well... What colour do I want? I think I'll just keep it the original, just for now. Here's how you look on Xbox, Game Attack and Game Pixel. Yep, okay, just click next. Save your password. Yep. Sign in faster with Connect. Oh, hey guys. Uh, get in your games. Oh, this camera quality is actually really good. Sign in with Connect sees you. Sign in with manually. Get in your membership info. I'm on gold, remember? Better not try and scam me now. Oh, good. Just turn my TV down. 18. Louder than I expected. And this is the new dashboard. So that's basically it. That is the setup for... That is the setup for the Xbox One. And yes, being Casual Savage here. Hope you liked this video. Please subscribe, rate, and peace.